Okay, we're looking north to the um, <coughs> to the far side of um, Warm Water Lagoon. You can see that sort of sphinx-like formation off to the left, and the ridge line. I'll come walk in front and see if I can point to the um, scree field. So you can see the, um, I'm going to go around the back of that cone, up on a ledge about 8 feet, 8 to 12 feet high. get to the top, I'll set the tripod up again. Try to get some pictures up there. It's pretty nice. a quick shot of the back of the um, the arches at the back of Warm Water Lagoon. Tides, uh, this is low tide, low tide about 15 minutes ago, minus 1.7 feet, about as low as it gets here. By the way, here's a view of the scree field, so I'm going to Climb up on this ledge, you see that line? I'm going to follow that contour all the way around to this platform. Let's see here, yeah, right about there. And then I'm going to jump up onto this scree field here and beeline it straight to the top. I'll do that now, time to waste. Okay, I'm at the base of the scree field, just wanted to get a quick shot of the arches. Lighting's not so good. The um, climb around was very treacherous. Just a sheet of ice. And here's kind of a view up the scree field. Kind of hard to get a sense of perspective. Okay, I'm at the top of the scree field looking back down. And kind of see the dark spots where I uncovered the wet rock underneath. That was my path up to here. Let me get this view. So you have Pelican Rock, Greyhound Rock off in the distance. There's the notch in that cliff in the background on that far wall. And a rare sight to see somebody at this far south, Greyhound Rock, on that rock. Anyway. Kind of running out of daylight. It's a quick view to the south. Pretty easy to. So my path down from here will be just kind of straight ahead down here, and right at that there's a saddle right there. You can go either way. 
kind of fun to go over this way, dodge that, that hole which goes straight down to the water and around the side. But instead, when I get to the saddle, I'm going to drop down about 50 feet and just contour around these coves until I get to the southernmost uh, notch cove, and that's where I drop in the water, and uh, I'll have my final shots from there.